Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filming a 1990s runway model makeup look. When I think of the 1990s runway models, who comes to mind is Naomi Campbell, Kate Moss, and of course, Karen Muddler, whom we're actually going to be basing our makeup look on today. I'm also going to be modeling a 1990s runway inspired outfit with jewelry, so stay tuned to the end to see that. I'm going to take my Tarte Tape Shape Concealer and I'm just going to start putting that under my eyes and around my nose and where there's any other redness on my face. bright and glowy looking, I'm going to go in with some foundation and just put that all over my face. Today I'm going to use the Peach Perfect foundation from Too Faced. Alrighty, that looks great. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my Bare Minerals Original Mineral Veil Pressed Powder and I'm just going to set everything with that powder. Now I'm going to uh, create some thin and fleeky eyebrows like Karen Mudler has in the photo. So I'm going to start off with just using some eyeshadow and putting it in my eyebrows and then I'm going to go in with an actual eyebrow pencil. Brows look really decent, so now I'm gonna move on to eyeshadow. shade and I'm just going to go underneath my eyes. well this is going. I know you don't want to hear that from someone who's giving you a makeup tutorial, but it is fundamentally the case. So as you can see by the picture, she is very like bronzed and blushed up. So I'm going to try to recreate that using like uh, warm tone blushes and bronzers.
highlight using one of my favorite highlighters. This is the Pacifica highlighter. It smells like coconut, so that's always a plus. <music> looks pretty bomb. So now I'm going to start working on my lips. So I'm just going to take my NYX lip liner in the shade Mauve and line my lips. Now I'm going to take this Philosophy lip gloss and I'm going to put that on top. word that comes to mind when looking how my lips turned out is a uh, moist. I'm gonna take a little bit of the stone vibed lip gloss from Urban Decay and I'm just gonna put a tiny bit of that in the middle for shimmer. Oh my gosh my lips have never been glossier. But now for the hair. Her hair is kind of curly but then it's flat on top and has a side part. Luckily my hair is already curly though so we don't even have to do that step. Too close, too close. I'm never in the Use some water and actually get my hair wet to make it less voluminous. I feel like we're similar people now. We have both have the curly hair, we both have the 90s, like I, like natural grunge. That's what I'm gonna call it. That's what this looks called. Natural grunge makeup. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put on my runway model outfit and show you guys the complete look. All right, so this is the finished look. I love it. I love how it turned out. It turned out super close to the original. Then, this makes me so happy. I decided to include this Eisenberg necklace, which is cut glass, and it's actually vintage from the 1950s. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe so that the YouTube algorithm picks up my channel. Also, if you have any suggestions for makeup tutorials that I should do in the future, please comment them down below, and I will do them. Bye! Thank you.